care of the duck. I'm killing him. For good? Yes. So he doesn't come back. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Finn, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. What the fuck shot him? I was supposed to do that. That's what happened, but it's obvious what happened. You said you could do it, Cat. God damn it. You said you could do it. Still have to deal with Duck. You're not pissed at me, right, Kenny? <laughs> That piece of shit. Hey, how you doing? I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Cause she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. If y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. Shh. 
She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand that's swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. Why the you fuck you get the ammunition in the, this world? Just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. I'm sorry to hear that. No one to blame. He's safe up here. You betcha. Okay, so in his bag, I can find scissors. Um, I can try to talk to Kenny, but I can tell you already that's nothing gonna go on. Hey, you and me, we... Oh, fuck it. Let's just get to the ocean. You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Care. It's the best plan. And if I could buy you for a second, Kenny. Can you just leave me alone? Hey. Yeah? Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Okay, so I need to move Kenny out of the way, otherwise I won't be able to get that map. What else can I talk to you? Um, I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. I think I can... No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, I think I can turn something off here. No, okay. full of maps and documents so one of those maps would be very useful for me but i cannot get kenny to move i need something else before that what are you doing so hey, shit hey aren't many of us left yeah you me and kenny clementine the homeless dude if he sticks around we're all homeless. You know what I mean. <laughs> There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah, I guess not. Charlie didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. See you. Yeah. The door to the boxcar. This is a bottle of whiskey. I mean, you're not gonna drink that with Clementine, right? That's something you give to Kenny so you can get a map. Fuck's sake. I'm assuming that's uh, Duck's blood. I hope we're not on this train much longer. I mean, if anybody needs a drink, that's Kenny. After a lovely day, she, he just had. Uh, also, I cannot give him the. Are you serious? You don't give me the chance. Get out of here. <laughs> okay, so I cannot give that uh, whiskey to Kenny. Why is that? I'm not gonna give it to the kid. Don't care. 
Uh, let's get the scissors from this guy's backpack then. I really thought that's how I get the map. Well, Clementine, you fuck now. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh... Tidy up a little, so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. <laughs> I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. The aim. You look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? I know these are just bottles. But you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. It might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Can I shoot us, Clementine? Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay. Let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yes. yes you do. Uh. Alright. To the right. And higher. Okay, a little higher. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Let's break one more. Higher. Okay. Aim a little bit more to the left. Oh. Uh. A bit to the right. More to the right. Close. Now keep it steady. There you go. Nice. I did it. Yeah, you did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Good. Just like you should. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. Hey, now the fun part. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? <laughs> Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Okay. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing.
do you know how to do this? Uh -huh. <laughs> no, no idea. I'm not much of a stylist, you know. I'm going to look like a boy. But think how much safer you'll be. I'd rather be dead. Shush now. <laughs> so you did kill someone before. Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Killing is bad no matter what. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. Doesn't make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay, I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with some. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There, all set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. I don't know if, I mean, you can still grab that ponytail. Right, I'm going to see if Kenny doesn't want the bottle yet, I'm going to speak with Chuck. I don't think he does. So I'm going to ask Chuck if I can drink his bottle, maybe, and that that's when I can give it to Kenny. It only makes sense for Kenny to drink that, okay? I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Uh, I don't know. No, nah, I'm fine. Suit yourself. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You don't know. Will do. Well, oh, perfect. I can uh, I can ask Kenny to come see the guy. Kenny's gonna move, and I can grab the thing. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. Woohoo, I can take my map now. Let's go back to Clementine. Just because Kenny didn't want to fucking give me... Okay. Just because he didn't want to give me the fucking map. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna ask the kid if you wanna go get a drink. Hey, Ben. Hey. See you. <laughs> hey, Ben. Hey, see ya. <laughs> it was me. You what? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. I could kill you. I... I... Nobody can see us. I could toss you over right now and be done with it. No! I... Please, please! Why shouldn't I? They said they had my friend. I didn't know what to do. Please, please. I would push him I off. Had to tell someone. I bet you did. If I had the chance, I would push him off. <laughs> no more talking. Well. Yep, I was right. The new guy is the mole. He's the one that made the deal with the devil. And because of her, we lost two extra... Because of him, we lost two extra crew members. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, 
you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. We need to know if they're okay. Well, if they're not, what happened to them? I'm sure they're okay. Huh. It's best to stay positive. That's what Dad always says. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. And we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There's a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and... Maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M... M... something... Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I... tell my parents? You know... feel good better i'm glad we have a plan and you're a good little chef thanks i guess we should see how far oh shit hold on everybody break That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This? Yo! You keep screaming like that, and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Define trouble. Anything that gets you killed, or worse, or it tends to come hand in hand with groups of guys in distress. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. Okay, all the way up we go. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. I mean, you have a gun, me. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Look, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Oh, shit. God damn, you guys have a kid. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit. What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great. <laughs> See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone, first day all of this happened. 
I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. Oh, ho, 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 ho. sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. That tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. We can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Okay, what's in the toolbox? Oh, it's a generator. It's empty. What's that tape? That's about the only useful thing in here. Oh, I want to see what's behind it. No, That's okay. I, I thought I can see what's inside. Any items I missed? No. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? <laughs> like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we are not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. So, yeah. Hi. Uh, again? The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, kid? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Oh. Well, let's see what's in the station. Station is the other way apparently. I cannot go through the bridge there. Can I follow you over there? You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. I have to go all the way to the stairs. Yep. Come on. Nice. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Hey, teamwork. She's giving me the pan, and I'm gonna. Can I shove it open? <clears throat> That looks barricaded, right. yeah. Forklift? Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. I can't see in there. Okay, how do we get inside this place? Got it. The window's open up there. Maybe I could look in? Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. 
Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? <laughs> what do you see? What do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. She did. Well, I'll be damned. Okay, let's get in. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. It's dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. With something what? Oh. Why would don't do that as a gun though? I'm locked up good. Well now you can use your padlocking skill. No, oh, I can do that to begin with Clementine. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. Okay, so if I if I look at this, I can yes, probably boost Clementine again. Not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. Okay, let's boost you. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. She's scared. Two zombies? Can I pick that? Thank you. I'm already spamming Q, yep. It's okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. She panicked. Oh, it's your first time out. Don't worry, rookie. Uh... Okay, I think you should. Keys down. <sighs> God damn. That didn't go so good. No, it did not go so good. Okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We found some walkers. You and an eight year old versus three of them, huh? We handled it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. I'm assuming this is not the Larry. I hope you know what you're doing with her. We're still alive, aren't we? Yeah, you are. Shut up and fuck off. <laughs> you probably should get rid of her. Okay, so I think I want this. We got it. Let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. No, Clem. We learned that everything we will ever do is dangerous. We'll get better, smarter, and faster, okay? Okay.
I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Oh, where's the blowtorch? That seems very heavy. I don't know how you're carrying that on the on the ladder. Plus, no mask. How about PPE, Lee? Shit. What's up? The hose is a leaking. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. Oh, that's the tape. Hope there's holes. Now it makes sense. I forgot I got the tape. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Whoa, thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. I can't reach it now. So how am I supposed to do the smaller, smaller cut? You can't reach it. Here, the weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! You're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. <laughs> uh oh. Ooh, look at the amount of that shit. Zombies doing there. It's going. Pull me up. Can he go? Shit. What the hell do we do now? Jump on the train? God, this works. Holy crap! We gotta jump! What? No way! Come on, smart ass, just jump. Guys! Come on! Jump! No! Jump, damn it! Still no! Fine! Idiot. Run. Run. <laughs> no, of course I'll take home it. Fuck, fuck this girl. She can run, you only have one leg. Baby, it's okay, honey. I'm okay. <sighs> to be honest, I really hope she's not gonna make it, but yeah now. <laughs> I don't like uh, those nosy annoying characters. Are you hurt? No. We're okay. Speak for yourself. My leg is fucked. Yeah, but you're alive. Is that gonna explode? No? Okay. That's right, this movie with choices is actually nice. Uh oh. My, that's a sad Kenny. Yep. Oh, 
Oh, he's not said Kenny that's some of the mustache. Next stop, the Atlantic. We find in Clementine's parents when we get there. I thought they were dead. Looking for them there. That's not the plan. Well, it's ours. She and I talked it through. You'll never get over today. That's all I keep thinking. Try to think about what's ahead of you. That's why I keep thinking. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. That fucking thing was broken. So did I. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents, y'all might want to rethink your plan. Almost at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? I know I promised that we'd find your parents, but Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you going to tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? If you come back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I will kill you. Can't wait for that one. Let's see how my choices were. So did you shot the girl in the street? 15% uh, Yeah, we didn't because that's a good distraction. Did you abandon Lily? Yes. Uh, did you fight Kenny? No. Uh, did you shot Duck? Yes. <laughs> and did you help Omid? Uh, to be honest, I only helped him just to get rid of her. Uh, you know. It's alright, I guess. Well, leave a like if you enjoyed The Walking Dead. And I'll see you next time with more.